Tanya. Hi. Um, can you tell us who, who, who are you? Sure. My name is Tanya Watkins. Um, I'm an organizer from the South Side of Chicago. My organization is South Siders Organized for Unity and Liberation, better known as Soul. Okay, can you tell us um, how did you get involved in your organization? Uh, sure. Um, I'm from, well, not I'm, I'm from, I live in a suburb of Chicago that has a ton of social and economic problems. I was super pissed off. <laughs> I wanted to, to change things for folks in my community. I want to change things for my family and myself. So I ran for public office and I won and I quickly found out that that was not the way to affect change in the political climate that I that we existed in. So I saw amazing work done by community organizers in and outside my community and I said to myself that this was really the route that I needed to go to affect change. And uh, why is it so important for you to to get involved into a movement or um, you said that you, you can risk your position, you can why is it so important and why why people should should move? That's an amazing question. Um, for me, I have a daughter. She's 10 years old. And I have a vision for the world that she should grow up in. I have a vision for the life that I want her to have. And I understand that in my country right now, that's not possible for her. It is my responsibility as her mother. It is my responsibility as a good neighbor to fight to create the world as I see it being, the world as it should be. And, um, and maybe if you could share your experiences and, 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 and your best practices, uh, because you talk a lot about organizing, but how do you do on the field for people who want actually to build a movement and to share and to galvanize people and leaders? How do you do? You know, we believe that the only way to build a movement is through discipline, through strategic organizing, um, through, like we talked about, using professional tools. Um, we have to be as smart as the opposition. We have to be as prepared as the opposition. We have to be on time, awake, um, and absolutely clear on not only who our targets are, you know, but what our solutions are. And you can only get that through um, very thought out, a very thought out methodology. You have to reach people. You know, we have to deal with folks where they are. You know, as, as being a marginalized person, I don't necessarily have access to the education, to the tools, but when we're building leadership, we pass that information along to each other. Good. And what do you think about solution like the one we are building? How can you, um, can it affect your your organization? So, Quorum would be a game changer for the grassroots movement. Um, when you put our ideals, our needs, and the people that we work with first, and build technology around that so that we can create professional solutions, so that we can have strategic targeted conversations, so we can capture data in a way that we can really use it to have, you know, to come up with like real um, legislation, ordinances that have people's voices inserted to let them know that they like have a seat at the table of power, that they are actually orchestrating their own change, and we can show them like concrete, real. Um, I shouldn't have had that beer. Like, <laughs> and we can show them like concrete, measurable results around that. It's absolutely exciting and something that we've never um, had at our fingertips. So this is an amazing opportunity for movements around the globe, especially in Chicago. Do you have another thing to say before we're going to get some beers at the bar? <laughs> I do. 
you know, for, I don't know who's necessarily watching this, but I imagine it is these, this will reach organizers all around the world. We have the same passion globally. We have the same vision. We have the same needs. But together, through connective technology, we can have the power to actually start a global international movement to make change where we all can win.